Yes, guys, you know what time it is. It's Division Rivals Rewards on the road to glory. Let's see what we can get in these packs. Just to give you a quick update, I don't think the footage uh, of me doing my hero pack went live because it corrupted and shit, but we went and got Robbie Keane, who is, is being all right for us, to be fair. Um, if I'm honest, Rivals just feel so shit gameplay-wise compared to champs, but we're still looking the same. We still bring these two on for uh, Modric and Grabenberg. And uh, my man center attacking mid, and then obviously these on the wing, depending who's who. Team's looking really nice, to be fair, as you would have seen in the last video. We did pack Van Dyke in our foot champs rewards. We've actually got a couple of packs already uh, to open. Let me, let me open these first. Oh, we've got a prime gaming pack. Well, let me just open these first. Why not open these bad boys first? I, I tell you what, if these are any good... We get like decent fodder because basically we want to complete Declan Rice, right? I do want to do Declan Rice. I think he goes right into the team, to be fair. So let's open these real quick and see like what we get. If we get like decent high rated fodder, I think I might take tradable results uh, just to try and get some, some more coins into the team. We're on like 180k right now. Actually, I think it's 175 because uh, I did buy a shadow for 5k. For Big Verge. And can I just say, this Virgil van Dijk cannot be the same one my opponents are using. Because my one's a bitch, bro. My one doesn't want to go into any tackles. He just wants to stand there. He's always got his hands behind his back. Just just jogging backwards all the time, bro. He looks, he looks like he's in handcuffs, my Virgil van Dijk. But, like I said, Rivals gameplay is shit. Rivals gameplay is absolutely disgusting. So, that could be why. You know, that could be why. I mean, that probably is why. I, I can't judge players until I, until I get them into Champions League. Uh, into foot champs, sorry. Qualifiers, foot champs, all that stuff. I can't judge them until I get them into there. We're getting nothing in these packs, to be fair. None of them are like really good packs. Everton, who's that? Godfrey. Oh, his um, Future Stars last year was sick, to be fair. Was it Future Stars or Rule Breaker? What's in this prime pack? Three players, 81+. plus. Let's open this one first then. I ain't had a single trailblazer, by the way. I had an option of a trailblazer in the picks, if you remember, but I went for Bukayo instead for pure ratings. Oh, wow. How am I getting... Oh, by the way, I just found this out, guys. If you press... Wait, what? I seen a feature the other day when I was watching some videos. Maybe because I've already done one. It, it's not working, but... um. Yeah, I seen someone say the other day, if you press square, it, it checks all of them for dupes, uh, for tradable dupes. Uh, let's open up this prime gaming pack. This is dead, bro. This is absolutely dead. I swear to God, this is a Rojo, isn't it? Ah. Oh. I would have been annoyed if it was. No, I wouldn't have been annoyed, sorry. because Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, shit in hell, bro. Shit in hell. I had a heart attack then. Bro, why would you do that? I was thinking as well, I don't have... Why is it cut off there? Why have they cut half the card off? One of the more important bits of the card. Why is that happening now? I don't want to discard all this. I mean, I probably will end up discarding it all, but... Right, let's do the player pick. Fuck me, I thought I had Haaland then. Oh my God. How am I getting so many dupes, boys? Because I'm putting my team into Easy SBC, loading it up and stuff. And none of them are dupes. There you go, square. Swap... Swapping all tradable duplicate items... Yes. I mean, none of them would... Well, one of them was tradable. That's sick, bro. That is gangster as fuck. Obviously, you can get discarded, my brother. So, it looks like we're going to go the uh, untradable route. Uh, we do have a preview pack. Let's do that. Just in case we get Lionel Messi, you know. Uh, English. Right mid. Is this Bukayo? Or is this Jaden Sancho? I mean, Bukayo would have been fire. A little walkout. Oh, no. It's Paris. Um, which is the cousin of a uh, football that I used to play with a couple of years back in Cardiff. Uh, random random fact for you there. She is uh, she come down to one of our games before and watched us play. Got a couple of autographs and shit. I do have these as well. What are these? 84 times 2. We'll redeem it. This is just a pack opening video. There's not going to be any gameplay involved. And here we are. One of 83 plus rare goal players. With this in mind, then, do we take tradable? Do we take tradable with, with these in mind? Or do we just flat out untradable, get Declan Rice over the line, 
What's the option here? 84 times 5 or a jumbo rare? Obviously the 84 times 5, bro. Are you mad? That's a double walkout waiting to happen. Fucking jumbo rare players pack. Some of the worst packs on this game, them and ultimates. Uh, what else we got? Ah, some dead packs by there. Some dead packs by there. We'll just go over to rivals. Get the, get the packs out of the way. Uh, what we got on offer? We got two rare mega packs, two prime golds, and 700 XP, which is well needed, actually, to be fair. Let's take that. We'll go on untradeable. We've got enough coins in the club, to be fair. But yeah, I kept fucking on this last notch. Kept winning, losing, winning, losing. I was like, fuck you, Brev. But uh, we should have got more objectives off the back of that 700 XP. No? Okay, fair enough. We're miles off of the, the level 40, which is a bit of a jarring experience. But let's do this. This is big packs only, boys. Hopefully we can get Declan Rice. One of three. 83 plus. Give me something big. Fuck me, Gabby Martinelli will take it. That's a decent little sub, to be fair. And I don't know, is it? A, it's not a better sub than Chiesa, really. But we got some bad boys here. Let's do the rare mega packs first. Is this a special? It's a hero. It's Kanu. What? How are we getting a hero in our pack and it's the worst one? Shit, man. He goes to 20k, bro. I had him on my other account. Oh my god, we got a hero in the pack, and it's Kanu, bro. Ah, oh, it's depressing. It's such a dead card, boys, I'm not going to lie. It's never going to get used. It's never going to get used. It's going to go in the Declan Rice SBC. That's jarring. Um, but we packed a hero. That's that's the title, bro. That is the... that's the Boys, I'm sorry you've been clickbaited if you clicked on this, but that's the title. We packed hero in our Division Rivals Rewards Standard. Hopefully we can pack a trailblazer to override that uh, clickbait. But we got a center forward. Who is this? Kramerich. Oh, hey, we get an inform as well, bro. We're, we're raking in the special cards here. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. Why am I doing don't show me this again? Right, he goes up there. Them two get discarded. We also got 80 pluses out as well. So now that we've opened these, we can basically get some 80 pluses in the gaff. Uh, prime gold players pack. I like a prime goal players. I don't like a Spanish player though. I'm not. I hate seeing Spanish. I don't care, bro. Even if you're Pateas or Patelas, whatever your name is, I don't really care for Spain, bro. Why is Siri going on a mad thing? Like, sorry if you can hear Siri in the background, lads. That's just Siri's being jarring. I don't know why it's doing that. Come on. Um, can't believe we got an icon in that bloody thing. That's crazy. Uh, prime goal players. Not icon, sorry, hero. Uh, Czech striker. This is Schick, isn't it? Is his name Schick? Trussard. Trussard. Schick is 83 now. Wowzers, dude. Absolute wowzers, man. Um, see, these people, they're just going to be discarded, bro. It's just a shame. I'm just I'm just discarding them. Because I got, I got packs to open, bro. I don't want to faff around. This is huge, mind. We got an 84 times 2 and an 84 times 5. So we basically got 7 84 players coming into the club. Let's see what we get. French, centre forward, Kareem. Kareem Benzema, let's go. That's great fodder for um, Declan Rice. I hear he's a good card, but I'm probably not going to use him, if I'm honest. But that is great fodder into the club. That's Deckers. That's got to be the 86 rated uh, thing of Deckers done, because I've got Trent Alexander-Arnold in the graveyard as well. What does he go for? Is he basically just um, just fodder price for, for 90 rated, really? Right, now we've got an 84 times 5. This is, I mean, this is almost guaranteed to be a double walkout, isn't it? Can it be a special? No, it's not. It's Modric. That's good fodder for Deckers. We obviously already have his road to the knockouts. What have we got on the back? Edison. Edison. Okay. Edison is the hardest goalkeeper I've faced on this game. So we'll take that. Have we got any, like, juiced danglers in the back? Any like bad boy 86 is like Militao or something. If we get Militao on this, it'll be perfect. No, we do not. We have three 84s and then the 87 and 88 into there. That is decent to be fair. We get a whole lot of fodder into the club. We we get a whole lot of just random goals that we can stick through the 80 pluses. And then we can also bring in Declan Rice. Uh, I'm not sure who I'm going to drop though. Whether it's Modric or Gravenberg. I'm not going to lie because Modric don't really do much. Gravenberg don't do too much either, but he feels more active. They're both medium-medium. That's the problem, see? That's the problem I have. But 
So yeah, quite a decent bit of fodder into the club there. We get Benzi. Bitches love Benzi. We get Kanu. Uh, we got Trent who we can use anyway. Little. Uh, Modison. Modison? Modric. Uh, Benzema should help with the 86 massively. And then maybe a couple of coins plus the fodder we already have for the 85. And we got 177k. So if we have to go ahead and spend 20, 30k for Declan, then we don't mind. But we'll, we'll go ahead and do him now. We'll fast forward. We'll transition to me completing Deckers and uh, bringing him into the club. He looks good to me. I, I like the look of him. Have I favorited him? Yes. I like the look of this press proven play style because everyone's pressing the fuck out of me. And I'm thinking this might be, this might be good, man. Like, this might be the one. And he's got bruiser there. He's got intercept. He's got block. He's got long ball pass as well. He looks like a really good pickup. Uh, what is he? He's medium high, so he'll be he'll be always be there on defense. Whereas Gravenberg and Modric aren't necessarily always there. Stick a shadow on him. I'm sure he'll absolutely fly. What we'll do as well is once we've done Declan, we'll rag out these eighty plus um, upgrades. Maybe eventually we'll do my man as well, but um, I don't know what to do with my coins. I was thinking of Jude Bellingham to, to go with Declan Rice or maybe Adair Militao to go with Van Dijk. I don't know, but let's just go ahead and complete, uh, what's his face, Declan Rice. We'll probably put De Jong in here as well because De Jong's dead, bro. I'm not going to lie, but let's go and complete Declan Rice. Right then, guys, come on. There's the 85 done now of Declan, so that's both of them done. I did put De Jong in there. I, just, I don't think he was a good player, to be honest, anyway. I, I'm, not, I'm surprised how much he still goes for. Like, I actually think he was dead, bro. Like, generally. Um, Rayner, I know he's a live card, but again, same. I've used him in squad battles for um, objectives, and he's absolutely pasty. So, yeah, we're, we're looking good. These foundation players we're never going to use. Raheem Sterling we're never going to use. So, we'll submit, submit, submit this into there and uh hopefully now get Declan Rice. I think I think Declan's a good one. He he comes into the squad chemistry wise it's good for Walker even though we got Edison now if we really wanted to use Edison. At the moment Giroud is undroppable. Whoa fucking hell just boot the ball in my face deck save. Um Giroud is undroppable for me at the moment. He's unreal. He's absolutely unreal. But we bring Declan into the club um that brings us to the end of it this episode we've done our rewards we packed the hero we've got declan rice and what we'll do now is we'll basically just build a bunch of 80 pluses and maybe even the team of the week sbc times two just just at that small tiny chance of trying to get uh jude bellingham into the team but uh oh the team of the week one seems to have dipped anyway bam it's gone so we'll just rinse out the 80 plus as much as we can uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Please do like, comment, subscribe. Sorry if I baited you with a hero, but it had to be done. Peace.